Hey girls and guys, it is Sarah from Style Let's Play and today we are going to be playing High School Cheerleader First Love. So I think by the title it's clear to say that it's probably going to be about a cheerleader Cheerleader, <laughs> a cheerleader who falls in love with a football player. But let's go ahead and find out. Oh, high school cheerleader. Hey girl, she's waving at us. Oh, today I got the enrollment notice for my dream high school. I don't know who your roommate's gonna be, but I hope she's nice because there's nothing worse than getting like a roommate that's like a mess or something or it's really loud or really annoying. So girl, I hope your roommate is the best roommate in the world, but let's go find out. Hopefully it's someone we could become best friends with. That would be perfect because then we'll get along and everything. Hi, my name is Vanessa. Nice to meet you. Hey. Hi Vanessa. My name is Amanda. I'm your roommate. The dorm is so messy. Uh -oh. Can you help me to put things in the right place? Yes, sure. Okay, so we already know some things about our roommate Amanda. She seems to like keep things very messy, but we're really nice and we just met her, so we're gonna agree to help her out. Don't worry, I'm here to help you, girl. All right, so let's see. We gotta put the nail polish away. Let's go ahead and put that in there. And we need this little like blanket to go in there. The room is definitely a mess. I am gonna say that. Let's put your notebook. First box is all packed up and ready to go. Now we need to put like our little eyeshadow palette in there. Uh, we're looking for some keys to our dorm. Those are very important because then you'll be locked out forever. <laughs> we need our textbooks. Very important as well because you need them to get your education. Uh, oh, nice little cute outfit, some nice heels, but they're comfortable because they have like the thick heel. It's not like the little heel that's like a stick that you can't walk in. Uh, we need a perfume so we smell good because we don't want to be funky in class. And we need a brush. What else do we need? A cute top. Is that the one? Oh, no, it's this one here. And last but not least, we need another cute top in case our first one gets dirty because we spill coffee on it or something like that because that would be really bad. Ooh, like a little present. Who doesn't love presents? I'm going to go with the yellow one. Ooh, a beautiful like purple heart. I was trying to think of the stone. Is it amethyst? I think it is, but I'm not sure. So don't quote me on that one. So we met our dorm. Our, our dorm roommate. She seems really nice. I mean, it's not that bad if someone's messy. It's not the best thing, but it's also not the worst thing. As long as she's not like a thief trying to steal my stuff, we'll be good. All right, so continue on with your day because first days are always very stressful and nerve wracking, but I'm sure Vanessa will be just fine. Finally finishing cleaning up the dormitory and I mm -hmm. myself is messed up too. I need to do a deep cleaning. <laughs> Okay, they always get me shook when they show up like this. It's like, I didn't know your face was that dirty. <laughs> but now I understand why you said you need to be clean too. <laughs> I understand. Alright, so what kind of, what should we do with your hair? Alright, let's brush it. Let's keep on. There we go. It's nice and simple. Girl, I don't, you need like some exfoliant or something. So let's wipe that away. There we go. So let's, let's pluck some of those straight eyebrow hair. Eyebrows looking on fleek. And we need our pimple popper. My favorite. Yes. There we go. And now, let's just put some nice little cream on your face to prevent wrinkles when you get old. Okay? We're trying to, to, to take preventative action here. So now, you're ready to go. You look beautiful. Honestly, I kind of think maybe you need to pick a different outfit, but you still look cute, Vanessa. I'm not trying to disrespect you or throw shade. Don't get me wrong, okay? <laughs> so, so far, 
so good. But still, we haven't found Mr. Right. So, <gasps> wait. Are we going to the football game? Are we going to find him now? Ooh, girl. <gasps> Cheerleader has always been my dream. Let's practice to be the best one. Oh, yeah. I forgot she was a cheerleader. Can we do B? Aggressive. B, B, aggressive. B, aggressive. B, B, aggressive. Oh, no. Okay, this is why I never made the cheer team. <laughs> I'll never be able to fulfill my dreams. Okay. We will ever be the rest. Here we go. Beauty Next Inc. one. Beauty Inc. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Beauty Inc. Beauty Inc. Go, go, go. I mean, they should just put me on the cheer squad. <laughs> okay, what's the next one? Running, skipping, we are the best. Running, skipping, we are the best. Running, okay, I can't do that though. My legs, they won't do that. <laughs> I like that move. Oh, when her friend Amanda's in cheer squad as well. Running, skipping, we are the best. Running, skipping, we are the best. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I think I'm, I'm, I'm filling a lifelong dream of becoming a cheerleader right now. Let me live in my moment. <laughs> and then the last one. I like that one. I like that move. Ballerina. Here we go. Oh, wait, what? I wasn't prepared for this. I wasn't prepared. Oh my gosh. Okay, girls, you need to slow down a little bit. Okay? Ah! I'm trying my best. I'm trying, I'm trying, I missed one. Oh, I think I did all right though, congratulations. They look really good put all together like that. My cheerleader exercise. A quarterback of the school football team came to talk with me. He is so cute and handsome. He invited oh, do you see how much she blushed? I am so excited. <laughs> Her cheeks look like little tomatoes. Oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. Oh, we got a yellow stone. Because yellow is my favorite color. So this is like perfect. Okay, so she finally met Mr. Right. Or we think he's Mr. Right. But you never know. She did get invited to the party. Which means she's probably going to want to look super cute. And we're going to have to help her. Because I am a fashionista. I'm just kidding. No, I'm not. I should prepare myself to go to his birthday party tonight. You do need to get prepared. What kind of look should we go for today? Let's go for a nice neutral look. A look that says you're not trying too hard, you know? So... Oh, whoa! She wants some highlights, girl! Okay. You rock those highlights then. I don't. I didn't know you were going to go with purple, but, you know, still looks cute. I like it. Still nice. Oh, we get to choose the color. Hmm. I feel like blue is too much. This that's a little bit too much, but it doesn't look too bad. Hmm. I feel like we should go with a darker color. No, too blue. That's not bad. If we do yellow, you can't even tell she really has highlights. They look more natural. I kind of want to go a bit edgy, but I'm a little bit scared. You know, usually I never take risks, but part of me feels like I should. For once in my life, I should just go for it you know and i kind of think i want to go with the purple this purple specifically oh i don't know i'm scared you know like what if somebody makes fun of my hair and they're like Ugh, it looks ugly and stuff and and i, I don't want to get my feelings hurt because then i'm gonna be real sad Ugh. i'm too much of a chicken i'm just gonna go with the yellow and now, let's go with the eyeshadow plus. I did say I was gonna go for like a neutral look, so it makes sense that I don't go too crazy. So let's yes, see. I like this color. Whoa. Okay, girl. I like the red kind of, you know? Kind of, kind of digging the red. Is there any other color? What about this? Or is that like too dark? I feel like that might be a little too dark, even though I do really like that color. We could try like a blue. I don't like the fact that it doesn't fade out at the edges. It's like a very, very strong, very, very pigmented. There you go. That's the word I was looking for. I think I'm going to go for this like reddish pink. I think this one looks good. 
And then let's do it on the other side as well. We can't just have her walking around with one eye that looks pink. Because it'll look like she has pink eye. <laughs> okay, that's very in your face. But maybe we could uh, make it look better. Hopefully. I want to put a nice blush color on her. That isn't going to make her cheeks look more red than they did earlier today. Because um, I've never seen someone's cheeks get so red. That does look really nice. I like that one though. Hmm. I feel like it's always a very tough decision. Part of me wants to go with that one. But if I go with that one, I think I'm going to have to change the eyes. Because they're just a little too dramatic. If you know what I mean. <laughs> so let's start over. Maybe we could go with a really nice mascara instead. You know? I don't want to really put any jewels on her eyes because I don't know how I feel about that. Let's try this. Oh, yes. I like this color. Oh, she says she likes it though. I mean, if she says she likes it, maybe this is the one. If this doesn't work out, what I'll do is I think I'll just go with no eyeshadow. I mean, that doesn't look too bad. Let's do the lipstick, cause right now she's kind of looking a little bit like a clown, Which you know, fit for me? a beautiful oh, clown. I like this color. Cause she does like that one, and I kind of, I like it, you know. I know I said I was going for, for, for a natural look, but uh, I mean, she is slaying that red lip. Look at it. It looks kind of hard brown. I wasn't done with you, girl. Oh my gosh. What have I done to you? I am so sorry, Vanessa. I told you I wasn't a fashionista. I told you I was just kidding. I have let her down. Now Mr. Wright will never be right. Because I just destroyed her chances with him. Because I made her look like a clown. Vanessa, this is all on you now. I hope, I hope that things work out for you and I'm sure they will because your personality is lovely but your makeup is not <laughs> okay wait it's a little bit weird I mean well I guess she does have to take a little gift so let's put all the chocolates away where they belong what's this one okay that one goes there the heart obviously goes there there's the square one. Ah, that one goes up there. Okay, perfect. So he's getting a box of chocolate. Mm-hmm. Because life is like a box of chocolate. You never know what you're going to get. So let's see. Um, oh, the pineapples are cute. Oh, that's nice as well. Hmm. I kind of... I really like the pineapples. I think they're cute. So we're going to go with pineapples. And now we need to go with... Oh, that's going to be the box. Now we're picking the tissue paper. Ooh, that's nice and simple. Okay, that's kind of a cute wrapping paper as well. That's a little snowman. I think we're going to go with the little polka dots. Mm-hmm. It goes nice with the pineapples. There we go. And now we need to pick a ribbon. Oh, we need to go ahead and wrap this. Perfect. That looks so beautiful. And see how all the, the circles connect? Makes it so much better. So now we need a ribbon or tape. This is tape, I think. So let's see. Mm, since it's just tape, I want to just go with one you won't notice too much. That there and there. Perfect. And now we need the bow. So we could go... We could go with that one. I mean... Let's try this. That is cute. But why did she have to put the tape on the noticeable side? You couldn't have done something different? <gasps> oh my gosh. Do I get to write on this? Because if we do, I'll just put like a little... <laughs> a little happy face on there like that. <laughs> we don't want to creep them out by putting like I love you or something like that on there. So we're not going to do that. Mm-mm. Now, we've got our gem there. I think, didn't we already get that one? I'm not sure. I don't think I did. So 
so now she's gonna get ready to go to this party. And uh oh, is this his house? You don't even know her because she just started at school. But okay, I'm not gonna judge you, you know, because maybe there's such a thing as love at first sight. So, okay, first we gotta fix that hair. Like, what have you been doing? Rolling in mud or something? Let's go ahead and shave that beard, which makes you look like a lumberjack. There we go. Can you at least smile a little bit? So let's do that one. This one. And the blue one. There, I made you your perfect perfume. Let's go ahead and stir this bad boy. Ooh, imagine if somebody actually made perfume in their house. I feel like the house would always smell like really strong. There we go. So now, can you spray this on yourself? Cause you smell real bad. Now, put on a suit. What kind of uh, what kind of birthday party is this? I thought it was gonna be like a high school party and it's gonna be fine and dandy. No, we're like getting dressed up like it's for a wedding or prom. Okay, I just got that one as well. Okay, unless they're slightly different. They all look the same to me. I just keep thinking I get the same gemstones over and over again. Okay, so last but not least, the moment of truth. Will he be Mr. Right or will he be Mr. Wrong? Let's find out. Oh? Hi, Vanessa. You look gorgeous. Welcome to my birthday party. <laughs> look at her makeup. Happy birthday to you. This gift is for you. Hope you'll like it. That is not yes, the gift I, I wrapped. Like Thank you so much. I'm just saying. Oh. <laughs> Lots of balloons. Real cute. Next on High School Cheerleader. How Vanessa fall in love with Chris. More High School Cheerleader will be revealed. What? Did they seriously just end it there? Oh my gosh, I am so devastated right now. Here I, w here I was like, I was like, are we gonna find out if he's right or wrong or what? But no, we're not because it just, boop, stop right there, wait till the next step. How are they gonna do this to me? I'm just gonna sit there and wait around for so long that by the time it comes out, I'm gonna forget all about it. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm so heartbroken. I really wanted to find out what's gonna happen, and now we'll never ever know until the next tap. <laughs> well, so it's at some point we're gonna we're gonna find out. So my guess is going to be, it's not gonna work out. It's not, because I got I, I have a feeling that there's gonna be like an ex girlfriend involved or something, or like there's gonna be some heartbreak, you know, some some sadness involved in the next one but we'll have to wait and see let me know if you guys would like me to do part two when it does come out i'll try to keep an eye out for it but like i said i actually do kind of forget sometimes like they tell me the next app's coming to come out and then like a week passes and by then i already forgot that i played this game so i will try it or if you guys really want me to play it let me know um if you guys happen to know when it comes out so I can make sure to go ahead and check it out. But anyway, you guys, as always, I will have a link to the app down in the description below. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!